Hello everyone. Welcome to this video lesson. In this video lesson, we are talking about refraction of the light. And the subtopic that we are talking about is the optical path of the light. Let us understand what is the meaning of the optical path of the light. Let light is travelling in a medium. Let light is travelling in a medium. It will be definitely having a velocity less than that of vertical light. Let that velocity is something like Vm, velocity of the light in that medium. Then, to cover a distance or a displacement, x let it take some time. Let it take a time of t seconds. And I can write a basic formula. Displacement equal to velocity of the light in that medium into t. Suppose velocity of the light in that medium is not given for us. But the refractive index of that medium is given for us. We know how can we write the refractive index definition. The refractive index of the medium with respect to vacuum is the refractive index of the medium by refractive index of vacuum. That is the refractive index of medium by refractive index of vacuum is one. By velocity of the light in the vacuum to the velocity of the light in the medium. Then I can write velocity of the medium which is not given to us as velocity of the light in the vacuum divided by refractive index of that medium. We have explained this even in the previous video lesson also. Let us take that into consideration and try understanding further. Now I can write the distance travelled by the light in that medium as instead of velocity of the light in the medium I can write velocity of the light in the vacuum by refract index of that medium into T. So x is the distance travelled by the light in the medium. Look at the numerator. C is the velocity of the light in vacuum multiplied by the same time divided by n. You know velocity into time is again displacement but that is the displacement or the distance travelled by the light in vacuum because c is the velocity of the light in vacuum by n equal to x implies the n into x is distance travelled by the light in vacuum in same time when compared with the time taken by the light in that medium that is what actually called something like optical path of the light. You can say x dash just for a reference and I can write x dash equal to nothing but an x. Where x dash is the optical path, x is the distance travelled by the light in that medium, n is the refractive index of that medium. This is what do you mean by optical path. Optical path is simply distance travelled by the light in vacuum when compared with the distance travelled by the light in any other medium. Now, coming back to this uh, derivation, I can use this derivation further to understand few things. X is displacement of the 
light in a given medium c is the velocity of the light in the medium into t by n suppose if somebody say light is covering equal distance in two different media if suppose that's a question distance is same velocity of the light is anyway same understand then clip the time taken to cross is automatically equal to ratio of refractive indexes you can also give another question if somebody say equal time in two different media this for example in that case time is same c is same x is inversely proportional to n r x into n equal to constant r n1 x1 so we can analyze the optical path of the light thank you for watching keep coming back for more and more video lessons thank you